let me welcome you to our winemakers dinner and thank each and every one of you for coming and supporting the Palm Drive Hospital and our Palm Drive Healthcare District. It is a wonderful evening and we look forward to the usual. I want to add my own special welcome uh, to each of you. We're very grateful for the support of this community and your ongoing desire to create a health care system in West County that meets the needs of every citizen for high quality, affordable, and accessible health care. Our pledge to you as, as the Palm Drive Healthcare Foundation is that we will continue to work diligently to assure that West County's health care will remain a model for the nation uh, with your strong support, of course. We're Longtime supporters, you know, of Palm Drive Hospital and excellent, outstanding health care that Palm Drive provides. Uh, we're glad that uh, Mike Lieb, uh, where's Mike? Mike Lieb is the CEO for, you, you can stand up, Mike, uh, for the Palm Drive Hospital. Uh, we are glad that you're here. We're glad that we're here. And we hope to have a fun evening and raise lots of money for Palm Drive Hospital and uh, West County Health. It's now my pleasure to introduce our Master of Ceremonies for the evening, our own 5th District Supervisor, Efren Carrillo. Uh, Just real briefly, I, I, I do want to recognize uh, the members of the foundation, the uh, elected leaders of the district, uh, and the enormous amount of time and energy that you put into making uh, health care, uh, high quality health care available to West County and rural Sonoma County. Uh, in acknowledging our uh, assembly member West Chesboro um, and in dealing with some of the budget issues that the state and that the county is dealing with, uh, I think that we both know that serving at the local level, whether it's at a district level or a school level, quite frankly, it's probably the most difficult to serve in when it comes to elected office. And I do want to acknowledge specifically uh, the folks that uh, are committed and passionate for serving on the district uh, as well as on the foundation. Um, the importance that you provide here in West County and for uh, the many residents of the county, whether it's our seniors, our children, or families, uh, does not go unnoticed. Um, we have had a significant amount of progress uh, for the district hospital, uh, and that is a credit to the entire Western Sonoma County community, uh, of which many of you are a part of and many of you are responsible for. Uh, many people have stepped forward uh, to donate of their time, uh, to donate of their heart and soul, but also to donate uh, out of their pocket. And that's why we're all here this evening. Uh, this is a uh, fundraiser benefit, and we hope that today you will uh, eat with your palate, drink with your palate, and, uh, uh, but also participate with your wallet. So um, that's my only pitch of the evening for you guys. Uh, it's been a wonderful journey the last three and a half years working with Palm Drive, and, and I have to say, We've achieved so much during that time. Uh, I think Dr. Powers said it, there are a lot of challenges ahead still. There are difficult uh, things that we need to deal with. We're gonna keep going and building, I think not just a hospital now, we, we got the hospital out of bankruptcy this year. Uh, that was a huge event. <laughs> But Rich is right, what's coming next and, and what the district I feel and the foundation can really focus on is building a health system for West County. That means home care for seniors. It means uh, managed, managing chronic illness at home and keeping people out of nursing homes and hospitals uh, and helping our seniors live longer, more productive lives at home. And uh, we all know that we're going to have to manage costs in the future. Medicare is really uh, dictating that over the next three to five years. Uh, and we're now doing some very exciting things. We're now working with six hospitals to put together a countywide, actually two countywide network of physicians and hospitals to provide care for our communities in the future. And, and I'm very involved in that. Uh, it's really exciting to me. I do want to thank one other person, which is Dr. Good who couldn't be here tonight because he's actually providing robotic coverage in two hospitals in Northern California. 
I've been, for the past six months, I've been very actively working with Dr. Gu to meet with him and his team every week. And we're building a very large business of robotic care that's delivered from Palm Drive Hospital. Right now, we're in seven hospitals in Northern California. Fortuna just came on recently, uh, and we're providing a lot of care throughout Northern California, not just here locally. So Palm Drive is really on the cutting edge in a lot of ways, and I think we don't, we don't realize how uh, advanced we are sometimes. But those, those systems come into play every day of the week. Uh, somebody comes into the ER, they have a serious stroke, the robot can go in there, we can get a neurologist with them in a few minutes, 24-7. And you can't do that in other hospitals in this county. So, Joan, do you want to add something? Um, mm -hmm. Well, every year when we have this event, it is such a pleasure to look out and see all of you here, that you represent our community who are supporting this most essential and valuable institution. And without you and all of us working together, it wouldn't be as healthy as it is. And so I want to thank you very, very much for, for coming here and for really joining together and recognizing each other that we're holding hands in this effort um, that, that we all benefit from because who knows when any of us might be there and we might be in ICU or our loved ones and to say, you know, thank you for our hospital that, that we all need in order to thrive. This year, the foundation has created uh, an award that's called the Healthcare Hero Award, and it's specifically for uh, people like Rich Powers. We thought it fitting and proper that Dr. Richard Powers be the inaugural recipient of the Healthcare Hero Award. Thank you. Let me just read what the plaque says. It says, the Palm Drive Healthcare Foundation is pleased to award Dr. Richard Powers the inaugural Healthcare Hero Award for many years of compassionate service in Western Sonoma County, California, September 26, 2010. my lovely wife Joan and I'm Dan Smith and I'll say that my a friend of ours called us recently and said that Palm Drive saved her life she had a drug reaction at home and went into anaphylactic shock and managed to get to the uh, ER fast enough to be saved and those are the kinds of stories that keep us working and keep us going on Palm Drive every day we are colleagues we are members of the community. We're family practice docs. We're family practice doctors. And we practice at Palm Drive Hospital when not at our offices. And we, we believe that having a healthy community means having Palm Drive Hospital. And that's why we're here. I'm Dr. Alan Bernstein. I'm a neurologist. I'm the director of the stroke program at Palm Drive Hospital. And with the support of a huge number of people we've managed to get Palm Drive certified as a primary stroke center. Uh, it, it's a real feather in the cap to the community. It's, it's great to have it available and I really enjoy being part of it. Jared Dreyfus. I'm on the Palm Drive Foundation. I am on the Palm Drive Auxiliary and I'm running for the Palm Drive District Board. I've been connected to the hospital one way or another since I arrived in town about 12 years ago. Um, it is unimaginably important to the future of our community in the whole West County, and I'm happy to be doing whatever I can to keep it going. Thank you. Hi, Martin Webb. I'm on the Palm Drive Hospital Foundation Board. Uh, unfortunately, I've had the pleasure twice this year of using Palm Drive. I was hospitalized for three days with a uh, serious cat bite. Had to have IV antibiotics, and then I had a, a minor surgery. But Palm Drive was wonderful. It's nice to have a local hospital in an emergency. It's nice to have a hospital locally in Sebastopol rather than go someplace else. 
Hi, I'm, I'm Greg LaFollette of LaFollette Wines. I've been making wine here in West Sonoma County for over 20 years. And uh, between my wife and I, we got six kids. Spent a lot of time at uh, Palm Drive Hospital Emergency Room. And I have to say a couple of things. The first is uh, a couple of my family members wouldn't be here without Palm Drive Hospital. And we have to say thanks for that. I just happen to feel that Palm Drive is one of the classic great American institutions that make our communities great. To have a community hospital like this is invaluable. And the people that run this place and the community that supports it and makes it happen is what makes our country great. And I'm happy to support it and to thank everyone for coming out tonight to be a part of uh, the fundraising drive. Thanks much. I'm Mary Edwards with Mary Edwards Winery. And I just want to say that I think Palm Drive Hospital is a key part of our community. Um, I'm a big supporter both with my wine and I give cash because I feel that this hospital is something we really need. I, I mean, my family has been here since, I think I've lived in Forestville area for, since 1977. And I have kids and my husband has been to the, to the emergency room, I can't think how many times. And we just need a hospital that's local, that's here. And um, my doctor is Dr. Roger Pitson. And he's one of the EM doctors, also a private doctor. He's been a big supporter of the hospital, and so am I. And I feel like we should all be supporters of the hospital. And I'm going to do this every year.